Howdy folks and welcome back to Settled Up Gaming. I am your host, the epitome of Southern Gentleman, Mr. Subtlety, joined by my slightly lesser younger brother, Ducky. And we're back again playing Wolfenstein the New Colossus. In the last episode, we saw members of the clan. We kicked Nazi Terminator ass and we stole a train. Well, are about to steal the train. I mean, we put it on the tracks, it's ready to launch. All we have to do is get aboard. And pray there's not more Nazis inside. That's why we brought this minigun. Anyway, let's get into the action. I suppose it's more of a high-tech laser pointer than a minigun. But it spins up like a minigun. Oh, yeah. Alright, we're on the move. Gotta head up front and grab the controls. Wait, you mean the uh, the launch controls are not at the front of the train? Let's get her. Is that a new gun? Hello, beautiful. Dock hammer. Yep. Finally, a shotgun. And. We what I hope is a shotgun. How are these Nazis not alerted to our presence when we killed all of their friends? Because they're not alerted when you legitimately throw an axe into the someone right in front of them. Ah, he's just lying down on the job. Interesting. I'm the goddamn Batman. Just don't get trigger happy when you've already got him. That sounds like it's above me. Well, you did see one above you. Yeah. So, let's keep going this way. I need a theme song. Did I just... Okay. That was, um, lucky. And... Unintentional. I was gonna go with stupid, but lucky... But yes, unintentional is also a thing. I'm gonna kill another one of these poor bastards on the can, aren't I? I actually kind of feel bad for the Nazis I kill in the can. Yeah, it's kind of embarrassing. It's embarrassing for everyone involved. God damn it! They just crawled out of the woodwork when they got alerted. Yep. I no longer feel bad about killing Nazis on the can. Also, from that last tooltip, you were apparently supposed to spend your Enigma codes. What? Yeah. Uh, at the base. On what? I I didn't get a chance to finish reading it. Mother fucker. Did that say what you spent them on? No, I didn't look that hard. He's not dead!
wants you to just throw those hatchets, doesn't it? Well, that worked. You know what? I'm not gonna question it. If they're dead, they're dead. Yes, I am spending quite a bit of ammunition making sure these guys are dead. But you know what? With that many Nazis who have, who I thought I've killed that have turned back around and beat the shit out of me, yeah. I'm not taking any more fucking chances with these asshole levels. Yeah, kind of wanted you to spend ammo here. I would just check every room and make sure. Yep, yeah, I intend to. Either way, everybody seems to be dead. Which is good for us. Ooh, armor. Cool. I've wanted to try out the new shotgun, but so far, I've really needed to just kill them with my SMG. Stay silent. Up or down. Watch! The Enigma codes are how we get more health. People have been screaming in the comments, You guys are the biggest idiots on Earth! Don't wrap me into this. This is on you. You're in this. You were in this the moment we put this channel together. Together. So many robots. Oh fuck me. I I wouldn't emerge there unless you don't have an option. I it didn't look like I did. There wasn't a path further down. I, I mean, I'll have a look, I guess. Yeah, it looks like there's one. Let's see where it goes. Um. Yeah, ladders in this game aren't exactly friends. I'm going back. Fair enough. Just making sure they can't come back to haunt you. Yeah, there's there's no reason for me to leave them intact. Fair enough. I know it's a little bit weird that I'm taking time to do this. But I do not want to get chased by any more goddamn Nazi Terminators. I, I will be very, very scared if they do come to life and chase you around this torso. See, that seems like it would have been very loud. Indeed. What? Also, please tell me you're going to get to drive one of these. Why would I want to drive the thing from South Park? Because they're mechanical monstrosities and they're hilarious. Oh boy. But... I didn't want... Okay, whatever. Whatever. Actually, we're at a train... Or, we're on a train. How the fuck are they broadcasting an alarm? How are they broadcasting... How are they getting help? From the rest of the train? We killed everyone behind us. I mean, there could be people ahead of you. But yeah, there still appears to be quite a few uh, train cars up ahead. Well, that was dumb of me, folks. Oops. Oops. Don't want that.
Well, it doesn't look like you have too much to worry about from these. Yep, we're gonna go up the ladder away and see what we can see. Damn, that's satisfying. That is a very effective gun. Time to put down Old Yeller and all of the Nazis. Where the fuck is that coming from? I think those are train cars. Yep. I would get inside. Hold on, I got something for this. Apparently, the sound of gunfire attracted more Nazis. Who would have known? Yeah, I would advise getting inside, because those things seem to have the advantage when you're outside. Well, this time I won't alert the, God the entire goddamn Nazi party. I told you we'd have to kill our way through the entirety of the German population. I wonder if any Germans take this. I mean, if they do, they're supporting the Nazis, so we don't care what they think. Actually, is this band, uh, is this game banned in Germany? I don't While know. On that topic? I don't know. That was just something. And high alert. I would seriously consider pressing forward as fast as possible. I intend to. Whoa! Goddamn dog. Nope, that's not what I wanted. Although that is pretty cool. Indeed. Oh. Fuck. Oh, you got inside the next train car. You were really close. Oh, hey! What a save. You just beamed him in the forehead. Plastic reloading! <laughs> Gonna get you killed! Has gotten you killed! I know! Maybe you should not do it. Fuck it, kneecapped it. Where are you? I'm the goddamn Terror Billy. I really like that name. Terror Billy? Yes. What does that come from? I'm a terrorist hillbilly. Is that really what it's supposed to be? Yes. Oh. Sometimes you just gotta sh make sure he's dead. I mean, with this game, it's honestly a fair point. Considering how many bullets these guys seem to take. Cool, got more grenades. I got plenty of shotgun shells. Oh, I, I, I've been here. All right, let's move on. Fuck. Okay. 
Okay, I got something for you, boy. I, I got everything you need. Come and get me. He's not gonna come and get me, is he? I don't know if he can fit in the door. It legitimately does not look like he can fit in the door. Fine, we'll do it this way. It's terror time, baby. Down? Uh, Looks like so. it. Pop your head out again. Come on, little buddy. Thank you. Another one of those turrets. Although that might be the gun to take a long way. Uh, maybe not. It was worth a shot. Well, concentrated beam with laser fire. Oh wow. Back all the way here? Yep. I remember the shotgun being kind of more imposing in the first game. Not to say this one is cool. But I remember dual dual wielding two shotguns being absolutely terrifying. You know, I didn't dual wield all that much. I'm a little bit more ammo conscious, I think. The only thing I ever really did was the shotguns. I, I can understand that. Since, you know, when you're in that close anyway, tearing through, you're not really going to miss. Yes, pop up that scope. So you can look down the sides. God damn it. Spastic reloading, man. I mean, I had six rounds. I wonder what the perks actually do. Well, we can stop and take a look at them. We'll do that in between episodes, folks. So we can just keep killing Nazi bastards. In fact, I think that's how I take them down. Well, that didn't work. Oh, nothing ventured, nothing gained. Right. Let's see if they make another strafing run. Pardon me, folks. 
don't have quite enough health or arm. Or, well, we have full health. We don't have quite as enough armor for my tastes. Of course, we may be done here. I wouldn't be so sure. You're right! One of those goddamn Nazi Terminators punched me in the face. Yep. While I was lasering his asshole apart. God damn it, and I'm back here. Maybe manually saved? Oops. We're your goddamn mother's vaginas, clown cars. You've made that joke so many times. Well, their mothers should stop getting pregnant. All of her children look exactly the goddamn same. You know, that's probably just the uniform. You know, one of these times you're gonna double tap that many times into one of those officers. And they're just going to disappear with the Enigma codes. You're probably right. I'm still going to keep double tapping them. Because another one of those times, that officer's going to get the fuck back up and murder my dumb ass. Maybe. Come on. You know what's coming. Yep, that's why I have this. He had friends. I don't like it when the Nazis have friends. It insults me, because I have no friends. That's Apparently. Sad. It does feel like the game's really alone. Does that make sense? Yep. Like how you had in the first one pretty often you had friends to help you out. Yep. And I'm sorry folks if we make a lot of comparisons to the first game. I mean, it's a sequel. Yeah. Where's that sound coming from? The other, uh... Whatever that thing is. And it's down. Cool. We're gonna get loaded up for the next fight. Wait, I, I think we actually looted everything we could. Might have. I'm, I'm sorry, folks, if my commentary isn't great, but it's honestly kind of hard to keep watching this with how bright everything is. Hail Hitler. Now, he came from down here. Didn't he? The Nazi Terminator? Yep, there he is. And you are dead! We got a little bit of armor for our trouble. That you need to put on. What do you mean? Oh, you were right, there was more of it. Yeah. Shit! Running again. Come on, come on. Shoot. No, you ain't, boy. You dead. Just be careful. There might be more of them. 
That's why we went and killed the Nazi Terminators first. They, they do an obscene amount of damage. Yep. I mean, what? how much damage would you expect a Terminator to do? I guess that's a fair point. Hello? More Nazis, please. I don't think there are any more Nazis. I have killed all of the Nazis. Behold my awesome sauce. This does sound like a bad idea. I'm the ghost of goddamn America and I've come to take your lives. Apparently you're not very good at it. No, no I am not. Anyway, I'm afraid that's all the time we have for this episode of Subtle Duck Gaming, folks. I have been your host, the awesome Mr. Subtlety. Joined by my younger brother, Ducky. Thank you all for joining us, and we'll see you all in the next episode. See you, everybody.